thermal power plants burn a fuel such as coal, oil, or natural gas to generate electricity. In Newfoundland and Labrador, there is one large thermal power plant, the Holyrood Thermal Generating Station, located on the Avalon Peninsula in eastern Newfoundland. The Holyrood Station uses a heavy oil called Bunker C as a fuel to generate electricity. Oil is delivered by ships to a marine terminal at the Holyrood Station. The oil is transported through large pipes into storage tanks. Eventually, the oil is used inside the generating station. When the demand for electricity is at its peak, typically at the coldest time of the year in Newfoundland and Labrador, the Holyrood plant can burn up to 18,000 barrels of oil a day to generate enough electricity. Inside a thermal generating station, oil is converted into thermal energy by burning it in a large boiler. Water is fed into the boiler. As the water travels through pipes in the boiler, it turns into steam. The high-pressure steam that's created from boiling water turns a turbine. The mechanical energy created from the turning turbine is used to run a generator. Inside the generator, a rotor acts as a large magnet. As these magnets turn, they pass over copper wires called the stator. The movement of the magnetic field across the stator causes electrons in the copper wire to move. This movement of electrons is electricity. A machine called a condenser uses seawater to cool the steam that's created when the water is boiled. By cooling the steam, it is converted back to water. This water is then reused in the process. At the Holyrood plant, three generating units can deliver 2,996 gigawatt hours of electricity per year. Inside the control center at the plant, Operators monitor the use of these generating units to ensure the electricity is there when needed. Electricity that is generated inside the plant is transmitted to large transformers where the voltage is stepped up and sent through transmission lines to provide power to the electrical grid. This power plant has played a very important role in electricity generation for the past 40 years. On average, the Holyrood plant generates between 15 to 25% of the electricity needed on the island of Newfoundland.